evaluate e raised to pi z upon z two z minus i raised to three d z, where c is the circle of mod z is equal to one. Remember, if this is a point or pole, I can say if pole raised to any power is coming at that time, always we have to apply generalized Cauchy's integral formula. So here, so first we need to simplify always. The coefficient of z will be always one, so we need to make it a coefficient as one first. So here you take two common, so if you take two common, it will become z minus i upon two, and bracket whole cube as it is. Again, you separate it two cube, which will be eight, and this bracket cube as it is into dz. Now it is simplified form. So here you can find that. The pole value is that is a value is out here i upon two, which means you neglect i and consider as one upon two. So one upon two is out here inside before one, or I can say that one is greater than one upon two. So therefore we can say that inside the circle. So if it is inside the circle, we can apply the generalized Cauchy's integral formula. So Therefore, it is given by integration of f of z divided by z minus a raised to n plus one of dz is equal to two pi i upon n factorial f raised to n upon a. Now, on simplification. So, before simplifying, see that the values of a is one upon two and n value is two because. Here they have it is raised to three means three can be written as out here n two plus one, so the value of n will be out here two. So on simplification, so n is two means here n uh, two uh, two dashes will come. Two dashes stand for out here double differentiation. So f of z is e raised to pi i that is numerator part of the given uh, question, and uh, if you differentiate e raised to pi z one time, it will become pi times. E raised to pi z, and if you differentiate this one more time, it will become pi square into e raised to pi z. So on simplification, apply these values. So 2 pi i upon 2 factorial, because here we need to simplify. N is 2 factorial. F double dash of a value a is i upon 2. But what is f double dash of z? We know here. So here you need to apply the value of z as i upon 2. So I applied. So pi this two uh, pi i upon two as it is. So here in this this value you need to apply in f double dash of z. So it will become pi square. This pi square as it is e raised to pi of in place of z you replace i upon z. So on simplification two and two get cancel. Pi i left pi square into e raised to i times pi upon two. But so the question having got here this is our uh, given required question. So we need one upon eight is missing here. So multiply one upon eight on both the side. We get one upon eight into integration of e raised to pi z upon z minus i upon two cube into dz is equal to one upon eight pi cube i into e raised to i pi by two. You club it pi. I pi cube upon eight, and you apply e raised to i times pi by two can be written as cos pi by two plus i times sine pi by two using complex uh, result. So, but cos pi by two is zero, and sine pi by two is one. So, zero plus i will become i. That this i and this i will become i square. Okay, so pi cube by eight, but i square is nothing but minus sine. 